It was a gloomy day for baseball, but that didn't stop day one of the Heilman's Performance Invitational from happening in Minot. Game one, Mandan taking on Watertown, Minnesota. The game's tied at three, top of the eighth, bases loaded, and Mandan's Lucas Burgum hits one up the middle to bring home a run. Chiefs take the lead nine to eight. A few batters later, Blake Ahrens hits one past the third baseman, and one run scores, but the second run can't beat that tag at home. Now, bottom of the eighth, Watertown's Anson Doulis hits one to right field. The throw home to off, the throw to home is off, and a run scores. Game tied at six. One on and two out, and Watertown's Tyler Thurston hits one down the third baseline to bring home another run. And Watertown walks it off with a 7-6 win. We have the Chiefs and the Vistas battling it out now. Bottom of the third, bases loaded. Minot's Eli Nissen hits one to the gap in left center. Two runners score. Vistas lead 4-1. Now top of the fourth, one on, and Mandan's Tate Jablonski gets some nice contact, and that is out of here. Mandan cuts the lead to one with that two-run homer. Later, bottom of the fourth, Minot's Trent Greek hits one to shallow left field, bringing home a Vista, and they go on to win 6-3. to three. The final game of the Invitational, the Minot Vistas in Pierre Post 8. Top of the first, one out, and Pierre's Cade Hinkle sends this flying over the wall for a solo home run. A lot of home runs tonight. His teammates, they're going to be waiting for him at home plate. Bottom of the first now, Vista's Braden McCarty pops this up into left field, but Elliott Life is there with a sliding catch to end the inning. Nice catch. Top of the third, Pierre's Aaron Booth chops it to the left. He beats the throw out at home for an RBI single, extending their lead 3-0. Pierre holds strong and wins 7-2. There were more great baseball matchups today outside of the tournament, like the Garrison Titans hosting the Minot Metros. Garrison wins game one and going for the sweep. Metros lead 2-0. Top of the first, Minot's Luke Ballas hits one to right field and is caught for an out, but one run comes home to score. My, met, uh, the Metros lead 3-0. Back comes Garrison Gunner Jacobs. He hits this one deep to left field, and he knocks it out of the park. A three-run homer in the same exact spot as last night. 6-3 Titans. Garrison's Gage Gehring hits one up the middle to bring a Titan across the plate. They complete the sweep with an 8-6 win. Now we head to Burlington where the Bulldogs host the Stanley Stingers. Bottom of the first, Bulldogs Brendan Hedges with a line drive to first. He beats the throw out for an RBI single. A few batters later, A.J. Kilborn sinks one into center field. That's going to drop and two runners are going to come home. They lead 5-0, but the Bulldogs would ultimately fall, losing 16-8.